All right, what's up, guys? Colin here, and uh, if you've been following along, we've been doing these challenges, and little by little, each time you beat a challenge, it gets a little more ridiculous. Now we are killing one chef, uh, one military guard dude with a sword, chopping him in the head, and there is a tripwire. A tripwire. Uh, we have to beat it in five minutes, and now they have added trip wires. Which, if you're watching the video, you will just see we just ran into one. Did you see where that was? Yeah. When you ran into it? I didn't see where it physically was, but I saw it once it went boom. But you know the area that it's in? Yeah. Okay. Because I'm slightly curious if you use your vision thing, if your vision thing pop will pick it up, or if this is going to be one of those uh, find them when you bump into them scenarios. Because that would be some bullshit. Alright, so we know how to get through this really quick. <coughs> Wait, I can see it. Okay. Okay. Yeah. What? Oh, you lucky bastard. He ducked. What kind of weird ass pose is that guy doing right now? Okay, so. You can see the trip wires now. So that is somewhat of a bonus. Well, no, that's not somewhat of a bonus. That is a bonus. Because you want to see where the damn trip wires are. Okay, two down. And drop. All right. Uh, bring up your vision first. Don't just like run through there. Make sure they didn't booby trap like the stairs. Yeah, but the booby traps probably won't go off for them. It was probably it would probably be just a you thing. Because games like to be cheap like that. No, they're lazy. I know I look fine. Oh wait, there they are. Oh, don't go out those doors. And there's two over there to the left. But he should be against that wall right there. Huh? Yep, he's right there. Was that? And time to die. What? Dunk. <laughs> and drag and drop. Drag and drop. And remember, do not run straight. Okay, so far, so good. Alright, uh, I think we just beat another challenge.
Oh, dear God, what is it going to be now? <laughs> it's going to be like, we added laser beams, um, there's going to be swinging pendulums. <laughs> oh, Paris escalated. Trophy. I'm guessing that's the end. Yeah, that's the end. Oh, okay. We um, we beat all those challenges, ladies and gentlemen. Okay. I actually thought they were gonna make it more ridiculous, but uh, they didn't. Okay. Well then. All right. Let's see. Let's see what we got. Uh, let's see if that one bottom one changed. Well, we had to kill the three people. Ah, oh, dear God in heaven. Servers disconnected again. Hopefully it reconnects quick like it did last time. Okay. Got it. Square Enix must be having problems with their servers because that is the third time. Nah, it didn't change. It's still the same. Okay, so get out of that. <clears throat> get out of those. Um... No, don't do that. I have no clue what this is. Um, let's see. Hold on. I know there's... This is all the future contract. Wait a second. What? Well, um... I didn't know this was an area I could go into. You know, go to where the chef is. Because you've already killed him. Unless... Oh. Hold on. Wear disguise, signature suit, lethal melee. So, what the I'm assuming that must be a, a neck snap? Lethal melee, maybe? So all three chefs you have to kill using a quote-unquote lethal melee. Okay, get out of that one. Go to the dangerously f flash thing. Oh wow, there's four in this one. Holy crap! Okay, and wear disguise, palace staff, palace staff. To get to her, you have to be a guard. To get to him, you have to be a guard. Okay, get out of that one. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, uh, click on um, click on the girl. I did not know there were these contract things here. I mean, I never looked either. Apparently, there is quite a bit more for us to take on. Okay, Vampire magi Oh, no, you have to do the Vampire Magician on all of them. Okay, that one, I can tell you right now, is going to be... That one's going to be a little bit hard for you. I can tell you that right now. Well, that's not even all of them. They just contract. What? in the world next oh are you freaking kidding me no 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 this can't be right click on that guy this guy yes just click on him Any weapon, kill that guard with any weapon, go over. How many people do you have to kill in this one? One, two, three, keep going. You know what this is? No. It's made by other people. Because that's in Dutch or Spanish or whatever. 
Yeah, that would take that Spanish. Oh, these are made by other people. I didn't know you could do that in this. Yeah, that's what the make your own contract is. Okay, well, I'm definitely not worried about that then. Because I know make your own contracts, you're not going to get anything yeah. for. But now the... See if that thing even pops up. No, there's, that's the elusive thing I was telling you about earlier. What is the... Whatever that is. Click on it. Can you play this? What is this? What, what's going on? Okay. The director? Eliminating, using any weapon, any disguise. Um... Screw it. Do it. I don't have a clue what this mission is. I didn't even know this mission was available. Well, I mean, technically you still do get a lot to do. Because the <coughs> one that I showed you before with the chef and the girl. There was like five game. people in that one you had to kill. Yeah, those were all game missions. The other one was where you make your own mission. So there's other missions that people have made. I would say you want to we want to stick to game missions, because those you'll get rewards for. I mean, I'm sure you'll get rewards for the people that create a mission, but I don't know. I I would rather stick to game missions. You might even get a reward for making your own mission too, like a trophy. That's interesting. There is a lot more uh, contract kills and everything than what I thought. But then again, I didn't really search that much. I just saw those two things that pop up when the um, that the main menu pops up. Those two things always popped up, so I was like, well, I'll do those. I didn't know about all that other stuff in there. There are a lot of uh, there are a lot of contract kills that need to be done. Holy shit! I mean, then again, they have to keep you entertained. Because of them only releasing one episodic story once a month. Welcome so I get. To Paris 47. The Palais de Villesca is hosting the fashion event of the year, and your target is on site to supervise Cicada security for Russian oligarch Viktor Novikov. Okay. Security is high, and the target is likely to be highly suspicious of anything out of the ordinary. Uh -huh. He's also sure to know each member of his team personally, so be careful when approaching him. Good hunting, 47. Okay. And he's upstairs. So I gotta kill the guard. Oh, you gotta hand it to him. Well, this <laughs> one's... I'm sorry, this is a restricted area. This one will definitely be uh, trickier. You need to find a guard somewhere, but you have to take the guard out quietly. So nobody else notices you doing it. Uh, I'm gonna assume probably not. So just jump that little area right there and hopefully no one sees you. Oh, he's gonna tell you you're not supposed to be trespassing. Yep. Hey, you. It's a restricted area. I need you to follow me. Are we clear? Yeah. You know what? You. Uh, never mind. Never mind. I was gonna say you could take him out right now. Then I was like, nope. Never mind, because the other guard's coming. That's fine, Mister. Just go ahead. Oh, and he's right there. Well, he's turning around and not paying any attention to you, so you could try it. 